All right, how's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I thought it would be pretty cool to do a nutcracker. So let's get going. We found another image on Google Images of how to draw a nutcracker and it has eight easy steps. And I think I might simplify it a little bit just so it's more uh, friendly to do. And we'll go from there. So let's start off with a vertical um, piece of area to work with. Uh, so if you're on a notebook or on a blank sheet of paper, I'd rather have you hold it uh, horizontally. But for me, I'm gonna make sure my sketchbook's like this. That way we have the tutorial on the left side and then an area to draw on the right hand side. So let's start off with what they have for us to do first. And that is the belt. And it looks like it's an odd shape, but I'm gonna try to simplify it. And I'm just gonna draw a rectangle uh, twice. And this is gonna be the belt buckle, okay? There we go. Next step is that we're gonna draw the remainder of the belt. So let's go this direction and this direction. And probably make it about this thick. We'll see how that works. All right, it looks like next step they did the top portion of the torso followed by the bottom half. So let's curve outwards this direction. And then kind of create uh, two stripe lines going like that. And then do a nice arcway towards the top and about about this high and curve around and it looks like i'll be going taller than this so <laughs> please forgive me i'm gonna have to edit this a little bit on the border all right next up after that they do the boots and um the legs so i'm gonna start off with the boots first i prefer that so two loops in the bottom relatively uh, right in between where the belt is and it's gonna be high boots, so I'm just gonna kind of create a shape that looks like this, and then mimic it on the other side. Notice how I did the inside of the boot, and then probably towards the top, towards the outsides. And then all you gotta do is connect them to the top portion, just like so. All right, it looks like the next step is to add the arms. So again, it is a nutcracker toy, so you wanna make sure that it looks nice and blocky, just like this. Let's do the remainder of the arm, so one here, and one here. And then this next part's pretty easy, you're just going to do a ball for a hand, and kind of disconnect it so it looks like a glove. And same thing on the other end, try to make sure that these uh, hands are very similar in height. Alright, looks like they're doing the next step, which is just the head, and I'm going to take my eraser right now, and try to edit this a little bit. I did go off track a little bit, so I'm definitely going to go higher than usual. That's okay. And it's definitely unbalanced from the edges too. That's fine too. Let's ignore what I just did. Alright, so let me just finish off these feet right here and move on to the next step. The next step is the head, like I said before. Let's do one curve here and one curve there. And it looks like it has a neat crown, so let's just do this neat crown right here. Let's make it nice and tall. And it looks like it has about a couple points. There's one point in the middle. And it looks like there's two on each side, so one, two, one, two. And it looks like there's a little bit of a circular dome behind there. So I'll do it like that. And then obviously the hair. So let's go back down and over, down and over. All right, next step. Uh, they have a couple uh, complicated steps going on next. So it looks like they're going to be doing the mouth, the chin, the beard, and the buttons on the side. So let's see how much we can do. Let me just try to follow their directions or their guide. Here we go. All right, so it looks like they kind of went down the middle here. It's gonna look kind of odd. And then it looks like they kind of create a line right there and then the beard kind of goes, meets towards the belt. There we are. And then there's about three studs on each side. So one, two, three, and same height for five, six. And then try to draw horizontal lines connecting them together, just like so. All right, next step. Oh wow, there's a lot of detail in the face. Let me try my best to try to mimic that. So it looks like they did teeth. Uh, this part is black, and then it looks like they kind of went above it. Just like so. Looks like there's some mustache here I gotta try to recreate here. So I'm gonna try to do my best here. It's looking okay so far. It looks like there's little round parts for the cheeks. The nose is wooden, so it's gonna look kinda like this. And then they have the eyebrows here, one here, one here, and then the eyes are closed. So one dip there, 
and one that there. And then they kind of shade in this part where the mouth is, all black. And that's it. So that is the Nutcracker. Um, I don't know if I have time to color it right now, depending how long this video is. And that's it. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.